group of Danes held captive. I've had quite the day. Look through the fog, Lee. Oh. Our camp is at its base. We'll return when we found the other. Leaf is a primer. Leaf is a prim and proper man, isn't he? Leaf is a prim and proper man, isn't he? He lives by a strict code of honor, more than most. And builds the best longships I've ever sailed. They're the reason we escaped Grand Bridge alive. Saxons surrounding that old hut. There may be Danes trapped inside. Vienna is like a grapevine, curly and hard to predict, while Leaf is like a wood... This longboat is Birnas, I think. All scraped and bashed, it's hard to tell. <laughs> Threat your wings, Sunan. His shackles, wretched carrion beasts. I don't deserve this. Leave me. Run.
the beacon has drawn the last of my soldiers. By tomorrow, our strength will have returned, and we can retake our city. I have not yet spoken to Leif, Birna, and Galen about this. After my missteps, I worry what they must think of me. It doesn't matter. What matters is how you lead them forward from this point on. By Thor's hammer, I am glad we're together. In spite of our setback. Galen, you look... well worn. Do not grieve the men you lost. They will be singing your praises in the corpse hall, waiting for us. Thank you, Jarl's Corner. Leif, you'd outlast any Tempest. It's good to be back, Soma. All as one. And know this, that I will follow you through the eye of the storm if you called. Birna. I'm delighted you're alive. I'm delighted to be living. I lost so many after all this, but I still have you three. That makes me the most blessed warrior in Midgard. And Eivor. You have more than proven your worth. Help us reclaim our city, and you will have an ally in me. My blade is yours. For Grandbridge. We'll rest for the night. Gather our strength and our wits. And at the break of dawn's light, we retake Grandbridge! Pass the night in our camp, Eivor. Take anything you need. More of Soma's forces followed the beacon back to camp. You're Vienna. And you are Eivor's sunbeam. You cut through the fog like the sun burns through ice. You're in high spirits, all things considered. The ambush, losing your home. In this moment, yes. But ah, you feel that? The moment has passed. We are free to pursue the next. What a gift! It's good to have you in this fight, Vienna. I like you, Eivor. You may help me here, or step on me. And by the look of you, I'd welcome either. Wigman's men in Huntons, pierced by boys through his heart. We haven't seen his sins in some. Leif, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast. ...and a poem etched into the hall... ...to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. A long ship is heavy with fate. Just a few lengths of wood between you and a ward or a grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you, Leif. Likewise, Eivor. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. Garlan, is that right? That's right. You are Eivor, the infinite fighter, a forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. And the wolves came. We all have our one day, the day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. The day is new, and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grantbridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd, none else. While you're on this ship, Dad, you fight for me, and for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her.
Drop the bag. Hush now. Two teams hidden. One on each side of the door. Move when you get the signal and. Turn Grandbridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. <laughs> what are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, even. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town. From a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those ridges dry without my guiding hand. Leave! Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigman, Wigman, let's try one final time! Quit Grantbridge! And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life! Ha! I command Grantbridge! I am master here! And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound! Let me give you some advice, old bear! The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. Now, Thanes of Grandebridgeshire, we take what is yours! Your side, so <laughs> raise your blade to me. Fucking try. You can't. 
cannot hide from me forever. Come face your death. Heathen eels. Wigmund is gone. He's gone. <laughs> <laughs> To me. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Arger coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city. My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating a morning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me. And the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? That is where I hesitate. Between Leif, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. 
Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. A betrayal so wicked, I cannot imagine. Yet someone willing to break an oath like that must bear some sign or defect. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grandbridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. doesn't waste time. Soma is just cursed with bad luck. Soma has only ever pleased the gods. Asserting her now, breaking your oath, that is what will bring us ill luck. Eivor, I am honored you have joined us. What's your plan here? All the Shire support Soma's ruling the city. These hamlets do not. They're feeding and outfitting Wickman's army. So we will burn their homes, quick and devastating, like the thunderclaps of Thor. How did you come to be in Soma's clan? A vision from Evolva set me on this path. It pricked my mind like a splinter, then faded. But I wanted more. For months, years, I ate only henbane, mushrooms, sacred plants, hoping to see something new. But my body dwindled. I lived addled, maddened, a wanderer, taken in by Saxons and spat out again and again until Soma found me. Naked and alone in the fence. She clothed and cared for me. Humbled as I was. I owe her my life. I'm eager to start throwing torches. Now let's rid these hamlets of Wickman's rats. Light your torches and set your arrow tips ablaze, Eivor. Red enemy of the branch will make quick work of this place. Leave no house unburned. This is what they get for helping Rand Grand Bridge from Soma. For licking Elderman Whitman's boots.
burning roof thatch and a heady turf. That was something. Wickman is sure to take notice. You stamped and roared like a fiery suitor himself, marching through the flames of Muspelheim. I'll see you back home, Drenga. Longer the nails grow, even when the corpse is cold. You I drive seen it, Eivor, my muscle banded friend. There's a nest of Wigman's men just here. We're going to pick it clean. Every last one. The fewer lies in the bush, the less itchy the pussycat. That's how I see it. How did you come to join Zoma's army? I'd been in England for ages before Guthrum, Ivar, Uppa, smuggling under the eyes of Saxons and Danes alike. I lied, stole, had my nose broken. Life wasn't easy, but it taught me how to bear the pain. I just laughed it away. When Soma took me in, she saw more than a smuggler in me. I was useful to something greater than myself. Useful to her vision. In a world where few saw you as worthy of trust, she's one who did. Right. And I love that about her. I love everything about her. We could talk all day, but these Saxons may fly from their nest. You and I should take a closer look. My men will hang back and come running if things go sideways. Fighting beside you should bring a thrill. Happy I can see it up close. Don't get too close. I might black your eye or bruise your head. <laughs> You'd lose your elbow before the bruises showed.
the last <laughs> You're light on your feet and quick through the grass. Sound carries over snowdrifts. I practiced by sneaking in and out of bedroom windows every chance I had. That's all of them. Ah, the solitude of after slaughter. Shame about this. You fought very well, Vienna. Is that how you flirt, Eivor? Is that how I what? Easy now, Drengir. I'll see you back in Grand Bridge.
Don't block the path, please. This priest blows as much air as a hailstorm. He cannot be allowed to keep spewing. Did you sell for us? Eivor! A fine day for being out, no? Soma said I would find you here, Leif. What's your plan? We're ridding the world of a priest who spouts praise for the Elderman and funnels tithes into Wickman's coffers. So the plan is this. We sneak in, gut the priest, and return to Soma. That will get Wickman steaming. How did you come to join Soma's army? We came to England together, sailing under Guthrum. The great summer army, the Saxons called us. When Guthrum left for Wessex, Soma stepped forward to lead. Something I would have liked to do myself. And what would you do if you were the Jarl of Grandbridge? I would run the city in my own way. I would not give Birna and Galen's opinions equal weight. Do you not trust them? I wouldn't say that. It's more. Birna's boots are stuck in the mud, and Galen's are in the sky. If death were bearing down upon us, I worry neither would have what it takes to carry us through. Good conversation, Leif. Now let's take down Wickman's man. Too right, too right. Wickman's wealth awaits his reward. My warriors will distract the Saxon forces at the gate. You and I will find the priest. Wickman should have killed you all off the first time.
Well struck. We made short work of Wickman's man. That we did. You've proven yourself an asset to us. I'll see you back in Grand Bridge. You'll get nothing out of me. Nothing! In Eivor, the plan worked. One of Wigman's captains caught him sniffing around your Ponte. Remember, you don't need to kill him. Have fun. I'll be planning our next move in the Longhouse. Little boy, little boy, where is your daddy hiding? Godless heathens. Grand Bridge is the province of Lord Wigman of Walden. The city is rightfully his. Poor soldier. Doesn't know what heathens do to men of God like him. Hasn't heard the stories, it seems. We can educate him. Look at those ham hands. Could make a nice pair of gloves. And his heart. A heart that beats in a lad like this? Feed a family of six for a week. Let's cut his throat now, and water the orchards with his blood. No, oh, sweet lord, no! No, no! He's on the Isle of Ely, Elderman Wigmund, in the monastery, I swear. Hmm, thought that would take till the next morn. Let's tie him up and let him rot away. Oh, fucking Dane Hackwitz! The lord will smite you from this land, all of you! May God have mercy on- <laughs> ah! That home thieving snake might have cast a curse on us. I couldn't risk it. Christians don't curse. Wickman's on the Isle of Ely. I'll tell Soma what we've learned. Thank 
you could thrill with the best. Eivor, what did Wigman's little man have to tell us? Wigman is at the monastery on the Isle of Ely. Hiding among the church mice. I'll need to plan our attack. But I won't face him while the traitor he commands is still under my roof. So what have you learned? Galen told me he was near death when you found him and saved his life. Yes, people thought him cursed. He was adrift in deep water. But don't we all deserve a guide back to the shallows? Leif disagrees with how you run Grandbridge. This city thrives under me, as a bustling port for his longships, for instance. Vienna used to be a smuggler, hardly an honorable life. There is honor among even the lowliest of men. Danes know that better than most. That's all the evidence I think we need. You've been thorough. Who is the traitor? I need more time to think. Of course. Feel free to search the Shire for clues, and speak to anyone you wish. Thor himself could now drink me. the regular sunbeam I've come to know. Something weighing on you? I was wondering on a few things. What happened the night of the attack? The people were at peace. A beautiful night, fog and all. Then came the Saxons all around. And Soma roaring like a great bear. When she called a retreat, we ran for the longboats aiming to regroup in the swamps. It was an ambush, no more, no less. I need to get going. You're back again, Sunbeam! I was wondering on a few things. You were a smuggler. Some would say that's not a trustworthy past. And water is wet, what a surprise. I'm an opportunist. I see a chance, I take it. It's helped Soma so far. She knows what I am, what I was. But she trusts me. Who would better know the difference between a joke and the truth? Vienna, Grand Bridge was not taken by fluke. Someone showed the Saxons the Longhouse Tunnel. And there's a possibility it was you. <laughs> you fight at my side, yet think me a spark of animal and a human skin. I know I'm a dedicated woman. It's a pity you don't.
Eivor, you look like the wind has flecked your sails. What's going on? I was wondering... How did you feel when Guthrum named Soma the steward of Grandbridge, and not you? If being honorable were easy, we would have no evil men. It is something I... I wanted, sure. But I'm a man of honor, above all. How did the night of the attack play out from your view? I was working in the shipyards. Next thing I knew, the city was burning from the inside. Then Soma led our retreat. Someone told the Saxons about the tunnel under Grand Bridge, Sleeve. There's a possibility it's you. You brew up stories better than anything I ever tasted in any meat hole, Eivor. I don't have time for this insolence. Eivor, this is a surprise. I was wondering. Why were you at death's door when Soma found you? I left my clan to pursue my vision. I don't remember much. The sacred plans addled my memory. But I was hungry for more visions. You may not understand, but Soma does. She knows the gods have a plan for me. ...and that following it is worth any risk. Did you see anything odd when the attack began? I did. I saw a wave of Saxons appear in the heart of Grand Bridge, as if by magic. Odd as wings on an eel. I fought ragged to the brink of death from one night to the next. You saw the end of it. Wolves almost took me. Somebody let the Saxons into Granbridge's secret tunnel, Galen. I believe there's a chance that it was you. You saw me near death in the fence, clinging to this life, and still you question me. Keep searching for lies, and you will be cursed for it. Now go! Did you find enough clues around Grandbridgeshire? Are you ready to choose the traitor? I need more time to think. Of course. Feel free to search the Shire for clues, and speak to anyone you wish. Did you find enough clues around Grandbridgeshire? Are you ready to choose the traitor? That's all the evidence I think we need. You've been thorough. Who is the traitor? Bjerna betrayed you. Are you certain?
This will be the hardest thing I have ever done. Stay close by me, Eivor. I will need you. How do you plan to deal with this? As a leader must. My family, my inner circle. Today we make sure what has happened to us will never happen again. We end Wigman's life. But not all together, for you cannot survive the winter with a rat in your larder. Birna, you betrayed me. <laughs> no. Wait, I could never, never. My heart grew so warm here, in spite of the cold. You do not love me as I love you. But love is not possession. You love me? You admire me? Even under your blade. I would do anything to stay here with you. Anything. You would do anything to get an edge. Say anything to spend one more day alive. It's how you served me so well. <laughs> Leaf, Galen, take her away. I feel as if I have torn off my own arm. Wickman deserves death, but killing him won't make your family whole again. You think I don't know? This is for those who follow. To join me is to take an oath. To break it is to suffer. We make camp on the outskirts of the Isle of Ely. Join us there. She carries the weight of leadership on one shoulder, and the bonds of her people on the other. Now that she's lost one, she walks lopsided. It will take years of toil to rebuild those bonds with her people. Yet she is unburdened now. Lighter. She is a leader, not a friend, Eva. Her mistake was thinking she could be both. Come on, I need the challenger! 